In this video, I would like to introduce our software uh, VCNN Double Bladed Sword. CNN stands for Convolutional Neural Networks, and here uh, V stands for Vectorized. So this software is actually a fully vectorized implementation of Convolutional Neural Networks. Um, since it's fully vectorized, uh, this software is able to run on both GPU and CPU very efficiently. Um, as we know that uh, there are already quite a few successful CNN packages such as Cafe, CUDA Confident, and, and so on. Um, while our package um, also provides promising uh, speed and performance, um, there are um, actually a couple of special things about our software that I would like to highlight. Uh, the first one is um, our software is written in MATLAB. Um, a lot of people love to use MATLAB simply because uh, MATLAB provides uh, many uh, convenient but very powerful uh, functionalities to make your life a lot, uh, a lot easier, especially to make your code uh, um, a lot uh, easy to write and a lot uh, more straightforward uh, to understand. So by using our uh, VCNN package, you can uh, completely enjoy all the benefits MATLAB can provide. Uh, secondly, um, uh, this software is actually a unified framework for both um, high-level vision and the low-level vision uh, tasks. Um, by high-level vision tasks, uh, I mean the task like uh, uh, visual recognition and uh, image classification. By low-level tasks, uh, uh, I mean uh, the task like uh, image denoising. Uh, since um, this package is able to process both high-level and low-level low tasks, um, this is why uh, we call this package double-bladed sword. Uh, to our knowledge, uh, this package is the first one uh, to provide a CNN-based uh, uh, computation fr framework to put high-level task and low-level task in one single computational framework. And uh, uh, this software is also uh, open source and already on GitHub. So you're uh, um, encouraged to visit this website to check out our code and use our code. Um, in the following video series, and I will talk a lot more about um, how to use this package and also talk a lot more about uh, various kind of um, applications that you can make out of this package. Thank you.